Hello everyone, I'm Ruchi Pakhle, an LFX mentee at Open Horizon for the Spring 2022 cohort and today I would be talking about my LFX mentorship experience. My talk is titled Roller Coaster Ride About My Journey. My talk would basically be focusing on two things, a quick overview of my work followed by my LFX mentorship experience. So a little about me, I am a soft, currently a software engineering intern at Red Hat and a final year student at MGM's College of Engineering and Technology. You can reach out to me at Twitter and GitHub from, the, uh, from here. So my talk would basically uh, focusing on two things, a quick overview of my work followed by my LFX mentorship experience. So let's start with why I chose Open Horizon. So I was very interested in DevOps and cloud native technologies and I wanted to uh, get started with them but have been procrastinating a lot and did not know how to pave my path ahead. I was constantly looking for opportunities that I can get my hands on. And as Open Horizon works exactly on DevOps and cloud native technologies, I straight away applied to that project and they had two slots open for the spring cohort. I joined the relevant channel and started becoming active by contributing to the project, engaging with the community, and also started to read more about the architecture and trying to understand it um, well by referring to their YouTube videos. So, uh, so uh, due to this, I got an opportunity to learn DevOps and cloud native technologies, and second is get hands-on edge computing. So what is edge computing? It is an emerging computing paradigm that refers to a range of networks and devices at or near the user. Uh, edge is about processing data closer to where it's being generated, enabling processing at more incredible speeds and volumes leading to greater action-led results in real time. Edge computing bring, brings computation and data storage closer to where data is created by people, places, and things. Open Horizon simplifies the job of getting the right applications and machine learning onto the right compute devices and keeps those applications running and updated. It also enables the autonomous management of more than 10,000 edge devices simultaneously. That's 20 times as many endpoints as in traditional solutions. So what is Open Horizon? Open Horizon is a platform for managing the service software lifecycle of containerized workloads uh, and related machine learning assets. It enables autonomous management of applications deployed to distributed web scale fleets of edge computing nodes and devices without requiring on-premise administrators. Open Horizon consists of management hub where administrative operations are centralized, each device agent combi combined with container runtime, and each cluster agent uh, combined with OCP cube platform for managing the edge. So let's see the main components of Open Horizon. So uh, Open Horizon has edge locations called as the Open Horizon agent. It has devices and clusters. So for devices, uh, it has a Docker device and Kubernetes as a cluster. Node agent, in node agent, there are several uh, nodes, register node, negotiate agreements, model synchronization, monitor agreement, and so on. So Open Horizon agent synchronizes with Open Horizon Management Hub, which is a centralized public or private cloud or on-premise a uh, Kubernetes platform, a container registry, switchboard. In switchboard, we have P2P messaging service, encrypted eavesdropping uh, prevention, exchange. Uh, in exchange, we have edge node registration, service publication, status queries, and etc. in the system state. So agreement bot and model manager are present in the model repository, and secure device onboard and secrets manager is present in the vault. So uh, now let's talk about my mentorship experience. So it was a really a roller coaster ride of things in a nutshell. So uh, what are my learning and improvements? So basically I uh, started with close to nothing uh, related to DevOps and cloud native technologies when I was accepted into this LFX uh, mentorship cohort. So I started with learning Go, uh, management hub nodes, uh, got to know uh, like what what are those uh, got my hands on uh, management hub nodes edge computing and so on so it, it was a great learning experience then key takeaways my key takeaways is that start small you don't have to know every each and everything you can learn on the go so take the initiative and ownership of your work 
seek feedback from your mentors uh, constantly, like within a week, within a mentor, or whatever works for you. So it it, it depends upon uh, individual to individual. Then face resilience in the face of frustration, which means that when you are uh, like when you feel like uh, giving up or something, do not because resilience is very important. Being patient and calm is very important as it opens uh, opens doors to. Uh, solutions to your problems so harness the community be community driven be active in community put yourself in the community out there and uh you know like uh, know what is going around what, interact with new people because uh being active in community are gives uh like there are a lot many folks that you are not dependent on college for anything being active in community gives a mark of what you are doing what you are uh you know uh pouring into the plate what you are bringing in the table so it is very important second is be community driven uh like you know uh whatever you do be community driven and maintain a balance uh, between all. So yeah, that's it. Thank you for listening.